Well, I'm joined now by George Hillyard. George, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good, thank you. So? Are you yeah, I'm very good, thank <laughs> you. You've got a fight with Scott uh, Hillyard coming up. Sorry, no, Hillyard. Yeah, yeah. The names are very similar, aren't they? Yeah. Um, they are. How are you feeling ahead of your preparations for the fight? Um, in great shape. So, um, no more talking now. It's just time to get on with it. Just, I'm just going to do what I've got to do. Mm. do. Do what I'm. To show, I can showcase my talent, basically. Mm -hmm. So I can get there and um, show people what I'm about. Mm. That's about that's what yeah, it was a shame he wasn't at the press conference today, yeah, really, it wasn't it? Yeah, could have had a bit nice, of banter. Could've, yeah, could have had a bit of banter, yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it would have been, been nice, but unfortunately. All right, he's, he's not here, but maybe you could send a little message to him now. Um, what would that be? Ram free. That's it. Oh, he's ran predicting free. The, you're predicting ran the round. Yeah, ran Interesting. What do you think is going to happen in round three? Um, I'll stop him. I mean, yeah, I can't see, it's only a four rounder, but I can't, I can't see this game going, going four rounds. Mm. You know, I, I do, I punch very heavy and I'm very heavy handed. So um, it's all about the time, if, about me. It's, if, if I've, got to, I've got to be fit first of all, mm. I've got to do things correctly. There's no point in me getting in there without a game plan. Of course, yeah. You know, so. How much are you putting into your training? I mean, are you at full force now? Are oh you yeah, it's, it's, we've, we've only got look, three and a half weeks, nearly four weeks um, away from it. So mm. I've still got 11 pounds to go. So. Mm -hmm. And um, she's not too much weight, but and I remember I ain't been 11-7 for four years, mm. so it's a uh, this is a good, it's a this is good for me. Yeah, it's you know, a nice healthy it's, weight as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, it's good. It's good. For, not fighting at 16 stone no more. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> just take a punch off someone. Especially my stone. muscle either. Mine was just being complete fat. Yeah, you know, I, was, I was a bit of a, a lardy. So, but I guess if you want to be in this sport or any any sort of combat sports like this but um i guess if you want to do it you've got to really put the the training oh, in and in in this sport it don't matter how good you are if you don't put the dedication in um you get beat by less less talented fighter as mm. simple as that and that's disheartening right yeah, yeah well, of course it is I've, I've lost fights in the in the past that um obviously sky sports and, and itv will big me up to be this mm. big prospect and then i get in a ring with someone that i should wipe the floor with and I get beat because I did the weight wrong, I didn't train properly for it. And someone that trained and done things correctly mm. uh, did someone that's got more talent. So mm. talent don't, in this business, talent don't mean nothing. But you know something, George? I honestly think you you learn a lot more from losing a fight than you do from winning definitely, one. About yourself. No, definitely, definitely. Yeah, and look, you know, records as well, records are, as long as you learn from them, but records are for DJs. Well, the so thing is, I mean, the only time that really counts is now. Yeah. You know, the past and the past future, the future hasn't even happened yet. Yeah. In the past is in the past. Yeah. You know, you can move forward. As long as you take everything that you know where you went wrong, yeah. and you apply that, then why not become all them things exactly. that you said you were yeah. going to be? Exactly. And I will. We will. You'll see. Next, these next two years, it's, uh, it's, about, it's about Paul G doing and showing people what, what I'm about. And, um, How old are you? 28 now. So but you're just coming into your peak, really, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, definitely. Well, I'll be 29 in a couple of weeks, as you say, mate. I mean, look at, look at Bruce. He's in his 40s. He's still smashing well, it. I mean, you know, yeah, he looks in good condition now, Bruce, doesn't he? Yeah, exactly. And you know, there's no reason why you can't have another 20 no. years. In Listen, the, I'm, I'll be another 10 years. I want to make another 10 years and say seven years. Another seven years of doing things correctly. And I do things correctly. And I'll be, oh, I can make enough money at this. Mm. So uh, I'll be very wealthy. And that's what it's about. So what does taking this fight for box office promotions, what does it mean to you? to take this fight on? Um, get my name and my career back on track. You know, as, as everyone knows, the last two, three years, I've been, you know, I've been, I've been off the radar a bit and um, personal problems and things like that. But now it's, it's about being professional and um, that's what I'm being now. Getting up and doing at night, 10 o'clock in the morning, uh, at night, doing me runs, six in the mornings, doing me runs in the gym in the afternoon, you know, it's, 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 it's getting off my backside and doing it. Mm. But before I was, I was going to McDonald's and, Eating yeah. in the pub, Stop drinking. <laughs> <Nice stuff. laughs> but you know, you've learned and you've yeah. come a long way since then, I should yeah. imagine. Oh, yeah, and um, I'm sure we're going to see that reflected on the night. Definitely. Definitely. So, yeah, I just want to take this opportunity to wish you all the very best Thank of luck for the 12th of October. Thank you. Thank you.